After months of controversy in his department, the Hales Corners fire chief abruptly decides to retire. His fire and police commission took up that issue tonight. Tom Durian was there and is live with what we know. Tom. Yeah, Steve, it was the only thing on this agenda for the regularly scheduled meeting. The chief, who, by the way, has been with this department for decades, up and left his job before they could get to that. 2.1 fire chief evaluation. The retirement, effective immediately from fire chief Martin Freibergs, took the fire and police commission and the village board by surprise. That's according to the village president who talked to us off camera tonight. Motion to open or to enter closed session. The commission went behind closed doors to discuss the personnel issue. The department has been in the headlines recently. Last summer, today's TMJ4 learned only one firefighter was on duty on Labor Day to protect the nearly 8,000 people in Hales Corners. This January, there was no one on duty who could operate a fire engine and respond to this car fire. Can you get us a mutual aid engine, please? Where would you like it from? Greendale. Crews from Greendale had to put out the flames. A police investigation showed the reason behind the staffing issue turned out to be a fire captain who left his shift without finding someone to replace him. That same captain, John Wagner, was later accused of sexual harassment. And just hours before he was to defend himself to the Fire and Police Commission, he resigned. And there's been no reason given for the chief's abrupt retirement. More information is expected in a press release tomorrow. The village president does tell me that all shifts here at the fire department are covered right now. And the police chief was sworn in as the acting head of the fire department. Reporting live in Hales Corners, Tom Durian, today's TMJ4. And we wait for more answers. Tom Durian, thanks.